how good your defense is in the first quarter. You got to feel all 40 minutes. Oof. Mitch Norton, great initial defense, and Castle West staying with it. They'd, they'd probably disagree. Plenty to argue about on Christmas Day, I reckon, there, Damo. Exactly right. Secret Santa, I just sent him trophies. <laughs> <laughs> Casper Ware calmly drains three. Well, you know that Mitch Norman's really hurt if he ever stayed out of the game because he hits the deck, he gets hit all the time and just finds a way to shake it off as Casper tries to get going on a nice little pull-up of his own. Sydney forced the turnover. Great defense from Dio Zada there. I was just about to say that Casper's going to draw that foul. It was 44-43 to Perth at halftime. Oh, Sydney yeah. going with them and now taking the lead back. Casper Ware. Four minutes left in the third. Perth by one. Casper Ware can take the lead back with the runner and does. Through every single on ball. Beautiful Kasper split. A little teardrop, he loves it. Back, and oh. look at that, the attempted jam from Blanchfield goes wrong. Now Ware, your school, Wagstaff with the miss. As Casper Ware says, right, my turn. Trying to shake Cotton, oh, he, he bakes two. The defense is going at Bryce Cotton on the other end, and his one-on-one -on -one defense, I don't think he has to. Corey Williams, you're a league MVP, Corey. How do you assess his form this season with his MVP season? Has he gone up even more? Well, they've exhausted all their games against the Phoenix, I'm pretty sure. So, don't have to worry about matching up with them anymore. But